Welcome to Homebrew Audio's Harmony Recording Awesomeness. Singing harmony with yourself. In this course, you'll learn how to record yourself singing harmony with yourself. Of course, this works for singing and recording harmony with other people, too. But here's how you can do it if you don't have anyone else around to sing harmony with. The process goes something like this. Record your voice singing something. Listen to that and sing along with it while recording a second time. Then listen to those two recordings of yourself and record a third version. Then add a fourth version of yourself, add a fifth, etc., etc., etc. Here are a few quick examples of what's possible. Helpless me hoping her harlequin hovers nearby, awaiting a word. Are you gonna take me home tonight? Up oh, down beside that red firelight. Are oh, you gonna let it all hang out, fat bottom girls? You make the rocking world go round. Carry on a wayward son. There'll be peace when you are done. Lay your weary head to rest, don't you cry no more. There are a couple of different ways to do this. The primary way, and the way I totally recommend doing it, is to sing all the parts yourself. And of course, if you're going to record with other people, you can have other people sing with you on this method. There is an alternate method nowadays, though, which involves having a program, either software or hardware, generate harmonies from your voice as you sing. This is not easy to do, and it's very difficult to make it sound natural. More often, it sounds like what it is, a computer-generated voice singing harmony along with you. Most of the course will be devoted to showing you how to do it using the primary method, but I will demonstrate how to do it using the alternate method as well. The basics of singing harmony with yourself using that primary method have already been covered in previous courses, but it was in courses that taught other things as well. And since this course is all about just singing harmony with yourself, we're going to bring some of those videos out of those courses and into this one. The first one is how to do this using Audacity audio software. Audacity is a free program which you can download from the web. In order to record yourself singing harmony with yourself, you'll need to know how to do some basic recording first. So we're going to start with the basics using Audacity, that free recording software I just talked about. Lessons 1 through 3 will start you from scratch, downloading and installing Audacity, hooking up a mic, making a recording, doing some basic editing and mixing, and then saving and exporting your creation. If you've already done that, if you've got experience doing that with Audacity, you can probably skip lessons one through three. Then lesson four and five will get into the heart of things, showing you basic multi-track recording and then singing harmonies to your own voice. Then we move into showing you how to do the basics and then much more using a more advanced but still crazy affordable software program called Reaper, starting with Lesson 6, which shows you how to download, install, and set up Reaper. We stick with that program for the rest of the course because it's all you will ever need for all your harmony needs, or any audio recording needs for that matter. This is truly pro-level software, and it's what I use every day in my studio. In Lesson 10, we present three programs for generating harmonies. As I mentioned earlier, this isn't for everyone, but can be pretty awesome and does have its uses. We start with the free method, Reaper's built-in revoice effect. This one doesn't actually generate harmonies, but it splits your voice into different notes based on MIDI notes that you create. Next, we take a look at the most expensive and one of the most popular harmony programs, Harmony Engine Evo. This is an amazing program with tons of different options for creating harmony parts and making them sound great. Finally, we look at my favorite of the Harmony programs, Z-Plane's Veelklong Instant Harmony. This one works differently, allowing you to edit individual harmony notes after it has automatically generated harmony parts for your song. So let's get started recording and producing some awesome vocal harmonies. <laughs> 